My husband and I started the Orchard Recovery Center um, in 2002. We're a smaller center. We have um, a maximum of 25 clients in primary care, which is uh, at the smaller end of the scale. So we feel we're more of a boutique style hotel. Uh, all the staff get to know all of the clients very well and all the clients get to know each other. When they get off the ferry, this sense of, ah, uh, it's relaxing, it's remote, but it's not too far away. People that are resistant at the beginning quickly realize, I really like it here. We treat clients with dignity and respect. We challenge their thinking, but it's not confrontational. And we believe that you should have fun while you're in treatment and throughout your recovery process, otherwise clients won't stay clean. And we are gonna match you up with a counselor that's going to work well with you. And if you don't like your counselor, we'll switch your counselor. We'll also set you up with a 12-step coach who's gonna work with you and understands you. We have, um, all of our counselors can help you with trauma. And I would say that the majority of people that come into treatment have had some kind of trauma. And we're gonna show you ways to cope with your grieving and pain that don't involve um, using substances that are going to harm you. So we're going to we're going to teach you all sorts of things and get you actually doing them while you're here. Journaling, meditating, working out in the gym, um, talking it through group process. We really believe in group process. Uh, when you listen to other people that have gone through similar things that you've gone through, it's really empowering to you to know that you're not alone and other people actually really understand what you're going through. And you'll see success. You'll see alumni coming back um, and you'll hear their stories and so you'll see, hey, they did it. Their story was very similar to mine and that provides you with hope. There's always somebody who's got your back here. Um, we're going to work with you through difficulties that you have. We don't expect you to be perfect when you get here. We're going to teach you the tools that you need and we're going to work with you and we're going to care about you and uh, we're, we're going to provide you with a better life.